going to take you on a tour to a nursery garden and show you some before and after shots of my garden with the peppers I brought from the nursery and also probably do some harvesting. So before we jump to the video, go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell so every time I put out an awesome video, you'll be notified. Alright, let's go. Plants. Wanna get some plants today? Plants today. Huh? <laughs> you always do that. <laughs> Pretty flowers everywhere. Yeah, me go there. I think there was a frog in there. I wish I could touch it. No, it's there. Gonna some plants today. Plants today, plants today. Mm. Yeah, that's your nation. That's what I was doing right now. Oh, so that's it's supposed to look like that. Yeah. Okay, okay. Good thing. Oh, look, they go, it's going to look like that. That's the nation. Looking forward to it. But it's no herb. Looking forward to it, huh? Here, Bella. No. That's how the nation goes, y'all. Look, taking this. Look at that. To that. Remember how the nation been doing? Look, that's how it goes, the process. I can't grab mine. Whoa. Look at the people. The hot peppers. Peppers, peppers. The sweet peppers. Cow horn peppers. Colossal. One of they so cheap. <laughs> Is it tomato? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can make them say Of course. We have the green thumb. What are you doing, Belle? Anything you got stuff in your shoe? Rocks. Yeah, I'm trying to put all the rocks over here. Cause it was so bad, I couldn't help it. It's really it. pretty. All right, come on, uh, the concrete. Morinacea. Hello. I'm gonna go on there, Bella. Hey, Bella, wanna come in here? <laughs> Ooh, hello. Okay. I oh, just hope it's wet in here. Whoa. Look, aloe vera. I got mine for eight bucks somewhere else. <laughs> Here. Yeah. Watch the cactus. Don't get. Don't touch them. <laughs> don't touch the cactus, baby. Succulents. Uh -huh, more. Snake plants. I live here for a lifetime. Hmm? I'm sure that these. Is she like, can I have that one? Don't you already got that one, girl? Uh, no. She has this one. I thought that was the same thing. Uh, it looks different. I like this one. Those are nice, though. How much is this? Can I have it? You and your father. I don't know what that is. Um, I can't see. It's just a fire. Oh, yeah. 
Yes, Bella. I guess. I guess. Yay! Had to pick it up. Ficus? Uh, I don't know what a ficus is. Or whatever that is. Is it edible? All right. This way, if it opens up. Is it edible? I don't know. This is the worst side of Guessless. <laughs> I have a plant. Let me look it up. It's a fuzzy plant. Look at this one. Sorry, my mind is thinking that's a cowboy. I love it. Orange is my favorite color. I do like Orange. Does it look cold in? Yes, Bella. Catling. These are. It says bug wing wing. Not true. Look at that. What is Whoa, this? Oh, mommy, look at these. These are so Love. pretty. Girls, I heard it. You got something like that, huh? Mm hmm. You know, she's been shopping. She likes this place over here. This is life. Garden life. Bikes. Look at these. Ah, clean it, Mama. Mama. Yes. Basil. More basil and parsley. I smell it already. Yeah, tell me it's basil. I smell it. Me? Yeah, look like mint. Mint. What is this? Mint. Oh, it smells even better than those. Different types of mint. It's, it's strong. It's like an extra peppermint, like the candy cane. It's chocolate mint. Dang. See, these are spearmint. Whoa. Different kind. Yeah, I, I want one of those. Mint, so <laughs> I don't know. You want one? I think you want to eat it. <laughs> you want one? Are you tea? Oh. I guess. I like Maybe. Whoa. You wouldn't know what to Smell it, Jerry. Smell that, that one. Not, that one's not enough for you. Look, like rub your fingers on it. That's the same it. one for you. It's bigger. It's a different one. Oh, my. Yeah. Mommy, I want it. We could use like, it with tea. Can you still got a little Yes, yeah, she, she's not letting go. Some, she's got some. one that's not so wobbly. Hi, Jerry. When we have this, we're going to make Maybe. a video. Come back to it? Yeah. It's not what I come for. Uh, we have that. We're no. gonna make a video of tea. No. On the hunts, the great hunts. Yeah. Look at that one. Is that grapes? Huh? Tom? Mommy, add some music on it. That's not grapes. Whoa. What is this? Look at the car. If we own this, we can own the like car. Own like grapes for a second. It's like a rocket bomb. Oh my god. Here the right coat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Don't so many it. colors. Yeah. Oh, mustardines. Another great I, I family. Go. Tree. Frog bit. Who want frogs at the house? Frog bit. Who, but who want frogs? Hornwort. Oh, I don't know, Jim. I don't want that. <laughs> don't know. I'm not one of them. Jim, look at those. Those will take a lot of water. I see. Got some plant babies. 
plant babies. Mm -hmm. Time to go home. Plants, plants, plants everywhere. Got some more plants. Plant babies. About to go home again. Out here planting some of my little plant babies. Gonna put a big birth in the back over here. I'm sure you can see everything. As long as no gust of wind comes, I'll be all right. Big Bertha. I'm going to plant it pretty deep down, so I'm planting it to like right here. I'll bury it. Make sure there's a good ways in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I bought the fence. What? I bought the fence. I got the, <laughs> the camera going. And I got the sweet banana peppers here. Yeah. Banana peppers. Put it in the back side. My mystery pepper, I don't know where I'm gonna put it. Well, I don't know what it is, sorry. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna put it right here in front of me. Ew, worms. Everywhere. <laughs> worms are beautiful, they're perfect for nature. Don't be afraid. Lies. Lies. <laughs> Good one. Uh -huh. Gone, they need to be. <laughs> Hey, you have been in the ropes. <laughs> <laughs> You'd have been running. No, I've been shanking with the dang <laughs> shovel. All right. Got to come back. That's close enough? Yeah. That's too close to the... Yeah. Back a little bit, huh? Mr. Pepper. Uh -uh, Mr. Banana. Mr. Bertha. Uh 
I must have mixed up <laughs> the mystery pepper. And my hot cayenne gonna go right here. Show about the poor. Love this lovely southern weather. So <laughs> huh? <laughs> don't say that. I was just telling us about the internet. Everybody from Louisiana don't sound the same. We most, heard you from down here. Cause most people think when they think Louisiana, they think New Orleans area. Mm, it's not deep enough. But everybody from Louisiana don't talk like that. Yeah. We do talk country though. I have been told a lot that we sound like we're from Texas sometimes. How true that is, I don't know. The world may never know. Alrighty. Y'all, so we back here. Um, things have changed a great deal. So I brought a, a lot more plants. Uh, I probably showed um, two of the plants in my last video. I might post before this one, probably. But um, which is um, another hot pepper and hot cayenne, and also these plants here. These flowers, <sighs> kind of dusty. Um, Portulica. Portulica. I guess how you pronounce that. If I butchered it, oh well. Uh, would show you these on here, but they, I guess they only um, really truly out when the sun is out. They probably just need water as well. It's these little yellow flowers down here. <laughs> when they're usually up, they're like up and out right now. I guess they just need some water. But yeah, let me switch this camera over. Alrighty, so let's get to this little mini tour of my garden um, after. So even though I didn't buy these from the um, nursery, I actually um, planted these in my house. I started from a seed and um, these three over here are eggplant. And these two here are chocolate cherry tomatoes. I actually planted them a couple months ago and I kind of stunted their growth. I had them in a, a small little pot. So I just went ahead and planted in uh, the bed and hope the guy that they sprout out. They look like they're making it, so we're going to see about those later. Um, here's my tomato plants. Um, probably last time you probably saw them, they was pretty small, but they're huge now. Pretty massive. <laughs> um, I'm going to uh, use some Epsom salt on these since my flowers, they all have a lot of flowers on them. Plenty of flowers, but the flowers keep dropping, so I'm assuming it needs to be fertilized um, and all that good stuff. So hopefully that'll do some justice and get the little flowers a little shake. Hopefully get it to produce some more, well, produce for the first time, fruit. And this is a celebrity and I think a beefsteak one, I think, tomato. And this is uh, what's left on my Nasha. Uh, the seeds are dropping. I did put some into the pot itself, so hopefully... By the time it starts to um, take root, I guess it'll produce more inertia. And I got a little oak tree in the back again. <laughs> and here are the peppers I got from the nursery. This is the banana pepper. Uh, they're huge, right? Let me get a good look at that. They're huge banana peppers. Plenty of them in there. And also, that's the little mystery plant that I didn't know it was. It pretty much is not really making it. So I was putting it in a little pot and hopefully got it as well. And the other one, uh, this is the big birth in the back. I think the um, this hot cayenne in front is kind of like dwarfing it, so it's like not getting enough sun. So, yeah, and I need to harvest these hot cayenne. There's lots of red peppers in there. I don't know if you can see them. They're really long. 
a whole lot different than my dragon cayenne peppers I had uh, a while back before it got destroyed by the ice storm. But it is pretty big. And my grapes, my lemons are growing back. My banana tree is coming back. You can also see that in a previous video that how much it like disappeared. <laughs> and now it's actually back. So and my orange tree here. And my blueberry, blackberry, and also um, bell peppers. I need to harvest these. <laughs> As you can see, there's a lot of peppers in there. Uh, that one is, uh, is sweet peppers. This one here. I also got these from the nursery, I think. No, I, I got some from Walmart. <laughs> and this one here, uh, this one got from Walmart as well. It's like doing, it's been back and forth, so I'm not exactly sure what it's going to do. You see at the bottom, they have new sprouts. But it's been dying up here like the other mystery pepper over there. But I think this one might make it if I just give it some fertilization, and I think it'd be a okay. And here is the jalapeno. Probably see one pepper here. It's real tiny. And my grape, which is going through a cycle, and the other blackberry plant here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my scissors, and we're gonna do a little harvest. All right, y'all. So here I got my scissors. <laughs> I have some little kid scissors, so don't mind that. So. I have never bought improving scissors yet, and my plants are doing just fine without it, so yeah. But if you're looking for a plant that you want to grow, uh, on the flip side, um, cayennes are very, very, very easy to grow. If you kill a, a cayenne pepper, something's wrong with you. <laughs> yeah. Nah, just kidding. You're great. But anyways, cayennes are very easy to grow. They pretty much, you put them in the ground, and they're like, they'll take off. With no problem compared to any other plant I had. Cayenne is like the most easiest plant to take care of, even compared to aloe vera. Uh -huh. All right, let me harvest this. Lots of peppers. So this might take a while, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, clip you over to the uh, those bell peppers in a second. Be right back. I almost forgot about this uh this hot cayenne I got a few days ago, along with the other flower I showed you a minute ago. This is one I got. It's so tiny, and I almost forgot to harvest these. <laughs> Colossal sucker. It's huge. I think I left this on there a little bit too long to start to change colors. And put you back up here. <laughs> Huge. Yeah, the sun's kind of hot, so um, I had to put my hair up. It got extra hot, <laughs> so I, did, uh, I think I had a good harvest this time around. Um, I still have a few peppers left on that tree over there, the cayenne. Uh, it wasn't quite ready yet, you know. If it's not completely red, don't worry about harvesting. Just let it turn all the way red, and it'll be a okay to pick. 
uh, I kind of let my bell pepper stay on a little too long so um, I, I went ahead and harvest uh, almost all of them I think I have like two bell peppers left on my tree um, yeah, so I'm gonna let those grow a little bit more um, I might do a video I might not um, I'm gonna put some Epsom salt on my tomato plants over there so hopefully it can start bearing me some fruit because I want some tomatoes yeah so if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and hit that bell so every time I put out an awesome video you'll be notified so go ahead and uh, check out my website uh, softness.com I sell lady apparel mugs jewelry you know I have it all on there so go ahead and check me out softness.com and I'll see you next time Bye, and don't forget to watch my other garden videos.